Hello children. Now we will start the next chapter that is chapter number 8 of your book. Getting to know plants. In this chapter we will study what are plants, what are the categories of different plants, how they perform their food formation that is photosynthesis and how those plants are you know are very important for us. You must have seen around yourself there are a large number of different kind or different varieties of plants. आप बच्चों अपने चारों तरफ देखते हैं बहुत अलग अलग तरह के प्लांट्स हैं सो देर आर अप्रोक्सीमेटली टू लैख फिफ्टी थाउजेंड टाइप्स ऑफ प्लांट्स आर नो दैट्स अ वेरी लार्ज नंबर सो यू नो द नंबर ऑफ प्लांट्स इज क्वाइट हाई क्वाइट लार्ज एंड स्टिल साइंस बिलीव दैट देर आर मेनी वेराइटीज ऑफ द प्लांट्स which are yet to be discovered there are certain regions on earth where we cannot be able to reach till now but we can find it so there is a large number of plants present around us then how we can categorize them how we can differentiate them for their you know convenient study to make their study to you know learn their feature easily ab itne sare plants hain bachche तो उनके फीचर्स को स्टडी करना इतना आसान नहीं है उनके फीचर्स को मेमोराइज करना इतना आसान नहीं है देन टू मेक इट इजी व्हाट वी हैव डन इज वी कैटेगराइज देम हमने उनको बच्चे डिवाइड कर दिया ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ देयर साइज एंड नेचर ऑफ देयर स्टेम द मोस्ट ऑफ द प्लांट्स आर क्लासिफाइड इनटू थ्री फॉर्म्स हर्ब्स श्रब्स एंड ट्रीज on the basis of their size their life span and their you know nature of their stem they are divided into three forms three sub categories that is herbs shrubs and trees so there's a difference to tell on the board but hey on certain parameters now we will discuss the categorization of plants into herbs shrubs and trees on these certain features first is height length overall uchai the herbs are shorter in length they are less than 4 feet 4 feet se kam hote hain bachche 1 feet is approximately of that much length between this stick to this stick bachche that is approximately 1 feet feet 1 feet is equals to 12 inches on a scale so they are always or usually less than 4 feet shrubs whereas they are medium in size what do you mean by medium or moderate they are longer in size than herbs and smaller than trees their height is up to 8 feet or usually less than 8 feet 8 feet is quite a good height beta next trees they are tall beta they are of many meters pine tree can reach up to 100 of meters eucalyptus can up to 30 meters mango tree you know it can easily reach up to 12 to 15 meters so trees have usually long length they are taller among all these three categories next is color of the stem herbs have green stem and green stem is referred as shoot basically shrubs have green brown they have they uh, some shrubs may have green stem as well some part of the stem may be green trees have brown stem actually that brown stem is bark present over the trees bark is the dead tissue of the trees which is present and covers them so next one next parameter was color of the stem and herbs have green color stem shrubs have somewhat somewhat brown or some part of it may be green whereas trees have a brown color stem stem is the part which you know anchors on which the other branches or the you know leaves originated that is known as a stem a plant has majorly three parts roots leaves and stem next thickness of the stem thickness of stem is diameter let us suppose this is the stem bache this diameter kitna ye gol hai kitna chauda hai diameter of it is referred as its size herbs have very thin stem herbs ki stem bahut patli hoti hai 
Shrubs have also thin stem, but their stem is, you know, thicker than the herbs. Inki stem bhi thin hoti hai, but that is thicker than the herbs, usually. Whereas trees have thick stem. Trees ki stem jo hoti hai, trees ka jo tana hota hai, in Hindi stem is referred as tana. It is very thick, it is broad. Next is hardness of the stem. Sakt, stiffness, rigidity. Herbs have soft stem. It is soft and flexible. You can break it easily by applying a large force. Shrubs have a hard stem. Shrubs stem is also flexible somewhat. Some shrubs have very flexible stem. It does not break easily. Whereas trees have a very hard stem. To break it, to cut it, we require specialized you know, devices like chainsaw or a specialized saw, manual saw. So for that, we require, you know, saw, a device, special device to cut them. From trees, we get the wood to make our timber for our furniture work, etc, etc. So, hardness of stem, the herbs have soft stem, whereas shrubs have hard stem, harder than shrubs. And trees have very hard stem. Next, branches pattern. <clears throat> you must have seen a tree better. In your drawing lecture, when so you draw a tree, you draw it like this. What this upper, you know, crown shows the branching in a tree. So, in herbs, there are not many branches present. It's usually simple plant. A leaf pattern over there. It does not have any branches, but Shrubs have branches, but branches present usually near the base. Not very, you know, distance from the base, from the earth surface is there. The branches are just near the base itself. Jad, jad wala jo reason hai bache, root ka jo reason hai, uske aas paas hi kafi sari branches hoti hai. Whereas, stems have branches in the upper region than the base. बच्चे पहले रूट चाहिए रूट का ये लोअर रीजन है लोअर रीजन से ऊपर जाकर देखो ब्रांचेस आ रही हैं यहां से ब्रांचेस निकलती हैं वेरियस ब्रांचेस एंड उन ब्रांचेस पर लीव्स हैं सो ट्रीज हैव देयर ब्रांचेस बट अ बिट अबव अ बिट द अपर रीजन ऑफ द ग्राउंड अबव रीजन फ्रॉम द बेस वेयर एज शब्स हैव ब्रांचेस एंड दोस ब्रांचेस आर प्रेजेंट नियर द बेस दोनों के में ब्रांचेस हैं बच्चे फिर फर्क क्या है व्हाट इज द डिफरेंस that in case of shrubs, the branches are present near the base, whereas in trees, the branches are present above the base, at the upper level. So that's the difference on the basis of branching pattern. Next is lifespan. First we'll discuss what is a lifespan. The average life which a living organism lives is known as average lifespan. It एवरेज जीवन काल एक ऐसा समय है जिसके लिए एक ऑर्गेनिज्म जीता है दे आर आल्सो लिविंग ऑर्गेनिज्म द प्लांट्स आर लिविंग ऑर्गेनिज्म्स सो दे हैव आल्सो एवरेज लाइफ स्पैन इन दैट एवरेज लाइफ स्पैन होता है हर्ब्स हैव अ वेरी शॉर्ट लाइफ स्पैन बहुत छोटा जीवन काल होता है बच्चे इट दे यू नो यूजुअली लिव्स फॉर वन सीजन और अप्रोक्सीमेटली टू सीजंस ओनली दैट इज हाफ ईयर वन ईयर अप्रोक्स वेयरएज शर्ब्स हैव longer life span than herbs they live for many years but their life is less than trees shrubs ka life span herbs se zyada hai they live for many years but not that much that is equal to trees but utna nahi hai ki trees ke equal ho whereas trees life is long they live for many years if obviously do not cut by human beings we are cutting the trees at a very rapid pace we are you know promoting the deforestation for our timber work without caring of the environment we are cutting the trees you must have seen in your life beta a region where tree was there now there is there are no trees buildings and buildings are all there beta so trees usually live for many years and they provide oxygen to us banyan tree may lives to 200 to 300 years even more than that so trees have a very longer life span for that is for several or for many years next is examples the examples of herb is mint tomato mustard sarsum next sunflower 
banana these are herbs although sunflower is a flower but it is a herb then the example of shrubs is lemon china rose it's a kind of rose it's a kind of flower and then rose plant they are all shrubs and the last one is trees mango tree apple tree banyan tree gulmohar all these are people these are trees bachche so that is the difference between the herbs shrubs and trees on the basis of various parameters like height herbs are short and uh, shrubs are you know longer than herbs that is less than 8 feet and so trees are taller among all these three categories color of the stem herbs have green stem shrubs have some got some but part is green whereas most of the part is brown and trees have brown stem thickness of the stem herbs have you know thin stem whereas shrubs have thicker than the herbs it is thin let it is thin but it is thicker than the herbs and trees have thicker stem moti hoti hai stem ka diameter large hota hai next is hardness of the stem herbs have soft stem whereas shrubs have a hard stem it is harder than shrubs and trees have very hard stem even harder than the shrubs itself branching pattern herbs do not have any branches shrubs have branches but branches originated from the base itself near the base whereas trees have branches and those branches present at the top at the upper levels of the plant branching pattern so life span herbs have very short life span usually one or two seasons shrubs have a bit longer life span than herbs that is for multiple years but less than trees obviously shrubs life span is less than trees and trees have long life span bachche so that is the difference between the herbs shrubs and fungal diseases to various kind of plants which we can easily observe in our surroundings you must have seen certain weak plants which you look crawl on earth crawl means which usually connected to the base itself which do not stand strong and against the gravity those are referred as a creepers but usually there are certain plants which do not have their stem upright and usually lies on the ground itself are referred as creepers why because their stem is not very hard not very you know prominent in its growth those are refer are referred as creepers creeper means ringna beta which usually adhere to the surface itself which do not go against the gravity and grow so the plants with weak stems that cannot stand straight on their own and spreads on the ground dispersed on the ground here and there are referred as creepers ऐसे प्लांट्स बच्चे जिनकी वीक स्टेम होती है दैट स्टेम कैन नॉट स्टैंड ऑन इट्स ओन अपने आप वो स्टेम खड़ी नहीं हो सकती सीधी सो दीज प्लांट्स वुड यूजुअली लाइ ऑन द ग्राउंड आर नोन एज क्रीपर्स द एग्जांपल इज बॉटल गॉड द बॉटल गॉड नो लॉकी इन हिंदी इट इज वी कॉल्ड इट अ लॉकी अ लार्ज ग्रीन कलर वेजिटेबल बॉटल गॉड सिंपल गॉड इज वन bitter god karela as well they all are creepers watermelon tarboos it is also a creeper mint pudina ye bhi creeper hai so these are the example of the creepers which usually do not have very strong stem and usually lies along the ground itself next one you must have seen a money plant with usually what mother or father does is with the money plant in a pot they hang a string एक्सट्रीम धागा बांध देते हैं वी ऑब्जर्व दैट मनी प्लांट विल कीप ऑन क्लाइंबिंग अराउंड दैट स्ट्रिंग हम देखते हैं मनी प्लांट उस क्लाइंब उसके सहारे क्लाइंब करता जाता है ऊपर चढ़ता जाता है सो दैट इज व्हाट द क्लाइंबर्स आर देर आर सर्टेन प्लांट्स विच हैव वीक स्टेम्स उनकी स्टेम वीक है सो फॉर दैट दे रिक्वायर अ सपोर्ट ऑफ इधर वॉल और एनी यू नो फिजिकल ऑब्जेक्ट और a plant itself so they require the support either of a physical object like wall like thread or a string or they require a support of any plant so that they can climb easily 
They are referred as climbers. So plants with the weak stems that needs the support of either a physical object like wall, string or a thread or they require support of any living, other living plant. They are referred as climbers. The example of climbers are pea plant and money plant. So they are, they require support to grow. Amrabel. Amrabel actually is a parasite. Amrabel ko kuskuta bolte hai bache hindi. Sorry, English mein kuskuta. In Hindi we call it Amrabel. That is also a climber. It requires a support and by that support it keeps on growing. So these are the creepers and climbers, the plants with the weak stems. Both of them are with the weak stems. One which lies on the ground are known as creepers and one which requires support to grow. These are referred as climbers. Now students, we will have a visit to Alon to study the various herbs, shrubs and trees. That is a herb, bache. Closely, it is a herb. Hai. It has a roots attached in the soil, in hair. It has a very weak stem. The green color stem is there. And the branching is present near the base itself. Branching, you can see, but 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 you its lifespan is short. It usually lives for only one or two seasons. Okay. So that's the herbs. Usually lies near the ground itself. They are not very, you know, fully grown. But they usually grow for approximately a meter. That's it. So these are the herbs. I'll show, a, show you a shrub. That is lemon. This is a lemon tree. For not fully grown. So this is its you know the system which comes out of the ground adhere to it look at the stem of it that is brown in color bache this stem is of brown color and the branching look at here bache the branching starts from the base itself so that's a lemon tree usually or a lemon shrub not a tree lemon plant bache so the branches look at here beta from here also the branches keeps on growing beta from here also so the branches are just near to the base itself branches are very base pass so it's a lemon it's a shrub its lifespan is usually more than herbs it grows for approximately eight years so that's what the lemon tree is all about this is the leaves the stems in here as well you can see these branches are green or somewhat brown they will are not fully grown but they will be brown in they are brown in color so that's the color of the stem the stems diameter is quite less as compared to trees stem jo hai bachche aap dekhi iska diameter jo hai iski thickness jo hai wo itni zyada nahi hai ye thickness jo hai so these are shrubs another shrub which i can show you now is this rose plant it has very you know fine spines present all over it but look at this pattern beta the branches all are coming near the base itself look closely this is the base bache. so the branches are you know coming from the base itself so that is a shrub it has a green stem and you know the branches is coming from the base itself and then it has a leaf pattern over it is that it this is a rose plant bache. and rose is an example of shrub so these are the shrubs, the lemon tree and the rose plant. Now, bache, I will show you a tree. Look at this, bache. a very thicker stem. The stem's diameter is quite large. You know? And there are no branches present near the base. This is the base stem. Now, if you look at the top, the branches will start. Bache. Although it does not have the branches, we cut it down yesterday. But these, you can, if you look closely at these, these are the branches bache. from there the various branches which are falling on the ground right now is has been cut down these branches bache, which are falling down these branches are present at the top of this tree this is a uh, variety of neem present in my lawn so that's the tree beta the branches are at the upper level from the base 
there is no branching at the base level and the diameter is quite thick so that is a tree and that's how we can classify classify herbs shrubs and trees